So we have a fractured tooth here today. We took out a large amalgam and you see this fractured tooth right here. I'm gonna try to get you a good image. And we're gonna do a build up today with a phenomenal material from GC called EverX Flow. And EverX Flow is a fiber reinforced dentin replacement. And the material when placed into the tooth places like no other material ever, as you'll see, it kind of flows but sits. And this fiber reinforced material is extremely strong. And when you cut on it, it cuts just like tooth structure. It's really an incredible material. I don't always get overwhelmed with a dent replacement slash core buildup, but this really fits the bill. So we're gonna start the procedure off. We removed our amalgam. We're gonna select the etch our enamel with some Ultra Etch. Normally I would put a matrix band on this, but I want you to see this. So I'm gonna select the etch the enamel. And then we're gonna wait about 10 seconds. And then we're gonna rinse this off thoroughly. And then apply G Premio Bond, which is GC America's universal adhesive. And the trick with these universals are, is that you need not only to put multiple layers, but you need also to really scrub it into the dentin. By scrubbing into the dentin, you're activating that material into the tubules and making sure you get a complete adhesive process. Once you've done this for about 20 seconds, we're then gonna lightly air dry. We're gonna use our air syringe to lightly air dry. We have an air syringe on our assistant side and we're gonna start further away just to blow off the monomer and then get closer and air dry. When we air dry, we should see a shiny tooth like you kind of see there. It's shiny, telling you your adhesive here is in place. And then we're gonna take our Velo light and we're gonna light cure this. So we'll use the Velo to light cure, making sure we rotate the angle so we're curing at all sides. And the Velo grand that we're using is a 12 millimeter head, so I know I'm encompassing the entire tooth. Now we're gonna use the EverX Flow. I'm gonna intentionally move my overhead light slightly, put a filter here, but I want you to see how this flows here on the outside. I say it kind of flows like Vaseline, but it's a moldable, flowable material that I can literally massage or mold onto the side of the tooth. I can manipulate it, I can place it. Notice how I just maneuvered that into place. Look, watch here how I just maneuvered that into place. I'm gonna go ahead then and just light cure that. And then in a couple of increments, I'm gonna fill our entire tooth. But the beautiful thing with this dent replacement material is that not only is it a material that flows magnificently, I'm gonna have my assistant retract here a little bit so you can see. So not only does it flow magnificently, And it's, and it's kind of strange, it, it kind of flows like Vaseline almost, but it's a dentin replacement composite. Notice it just sits there. And now I can take my plastic instrument, I can manipulate it any way I want, making sure my gingival margin is totally sealed, maneuvering around the buckle. You see, I can literally move it wherever I want to move it. I'm gonna hit that with my curing light. And then add a little more on the buckle. Just to fill in all my gaps. And it comes in a dentin shade. It comes in a number of different shades. And then I'm gonna prep it back and adjust it. 
One final layer here on the buckle. Just kind of giving it its full appearance of a tooth. And you can see how easily I can manipulate this material. Again, light cure. And then I'll prep it back and I'll show you the final once I prep it back. Just to give you an idea how this material will prep, just like tooth structure. So literally, I'm on the tooth and this material cuts just like tooth structure, and that's the beauty of this. There's no nooks, there's no stepping. It'll just prep off really easily. And that's the beautiful thing about this Everex Flow material from GC, so check it out. And I would encourage you to incorporate this new product into practice.